Legacy Model VP. Naku, lakad mo. Lakad mo. Lakad mo. Lakad mo. On what we're assuming to be a middle pick for TSM. And there it is. That will be the Viper. I gotta say, I love me some Sky Snake. Maybe not as much as ET does. That man, uh, that man decides who gets the Viper Whoa. Pass or not. Low. The Dawnbreaker is low, and Knight will die to the tower, looking for first blood. He needs one more hit, and he will get it under the tower. Thunder awakens very own Knight, gets first blood. He will die under the tower to the support Tiny. But now Ari tosses the tree over, gets a double kill. Britain's very own... Rotation top lane, that's Spirit Breaker TPing in. He'll have the charge in this 3v2. Goes towards Saberlight, both are stunned. Hammer in, but an avalanche comes through by Ari. Everyone's taking a lot of damage from this top lane. Stun through, comes through the Saberlight. Fifi in from Illich and the Furion. Michael is running away. Saberlight goes down. It's one Viper dead in a 2v4. Ari will escape. I think if you're uh, TS, it'll be there eventually. Knight preps the overpower. Thunder Awaken want to win this fight. Excel's walking in. He'll hammer Saberlight. If Saberlight dies, the TP will be on cooldown. Stun is canceled by Ari. Charge comes through. Saberlight's half HP. Excel is already dead. But the trade will be for Saberlight. Brought down by Ursa. They move to Tiny. She has a toss. He has a win. Is this one of those games where we should have Ari start farming? Yes. <laughs> Over to mid lane. Meanwhile, we see Bryo the target. Charged through by Michael. Sapphire is low, bash it under the tower, Avalanche comes through, stunning the tusk, in comes Moon Meander, but he's stopped by Excel. Bryle will cookie stun on both, alone is already dead, Michael's on the run, a huge turn from Bryle and Ari. Moon Meander has been stunned by Excel, but he's still alive, hammer through, Moon will drop, Bryle low, Scatter Blast saves him, Excel goes down. A three for one, route in favor of TSM. <sighs> yeah, you've got next to life on the position one, just hitting creeps, not a carry. Meanwhile, the middle lane. You see, oh, that's a very dead Dawnbreaker, it appears. Tusk will attempt the snowball through. Excel is low, but not dead yet. Shards hit onto. Illich TP is in, so does Moon Meander. Bryle is low, Ari is low. Excel is actually still alive, but in comes a big bat spin. He turns red, slapping Furion. Michael looks for a bash. Stormbolt on Furion. He's cleaving, bringing down Excel with the cleave damage, bringing down Illich, heading to alone. He's one third HP. No snowball, half HP. Shards through, goes for Moon Meander. He wants to kill, but he's already dead. A triple kill for the spin. Michael is forced to charge away, and what a great TP rotation by TSM. Back into TSM, but I think the Thunder, the Sinister Gaze, this ability works pretty weird. This one alongside... Meanwhile, over the bottom lane, Illich is already dead. They're moving over to Michael. He still is a Spirit Breaker, but he's being run at. Avalanche is up. It will be used. Tomato has Stormbolt in two. Michael charges away in time. Over to mid lane. Oh, no. I, I simply cannot gaze in the thoughts of Mumienda. The guy's brain is too big. I... He's got, uh, I cannot possibly understand his plans. Mid lane, Aghanim stunned from Snapfire. Ursa the target and enraged in time. Solar Guardian will keep him a little bit more healed up. Punch comes through there on Ari. Stormbolt is there on Excel. Dawnbreaker is very dead with that dead Dawnbreaker. Problem is, Bryle's in a lot of danger. Charged by Michael, gone on by Excel. Ninja Prophet TP is in, Orchid is through. Snapfire is dropping and inevitably will die. Ari will attempt to save the Orchid afterburn, will bring down the Snapfire. It's time to now run away. Saberlay has rotated in to try to fight. He'll uh, Viper Strike Excel, who's already down to one third HP. Correction, zero HP. Tomato's here as well on the north side of the fight, looking for a wraparound angle on perhaps Illich, but instead he'll run towards Alone, who's. He's starting to get a pretty significant net worth advantage over everyone in the game. Well, this could be the big play here. Four man smoke, but it's tanked by Ari. They'll attempt to save him. They'll toss an avalanche over to Alone, who's already low on HP. Excel with Solar Guardian. Stun comes through again, but the Chain Frost is bouncing around alone. It's already dead. Michael, the new target, joins him in the grave. And they sinister gaze. Knight! He's tossed on up. Stunned by the cookie. And there we go. Three kills for TSM. Excel will get away, but that's a disastrous fight again for Thunder Awaken. Yeah, I'll give him that for that. That was a fantastic reason to so Meanwhile, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Meanwhile, the track camp will break the mid lane again. Avalanche Tosser there on alone. He'll snowball, but it's towards Ari this time around. He'll attempt to get away, but his blink has been canceled, and his life, too, has been canceled. Major Fossil will BKB attempting to fight there. Trick is there on Saber. Light, Chain Frost is bouncing. Avalanche comes through. Saber is there, but it's 3 for 1 in TSM Saber. Knight's BKB is going to end quite soon, and TSM want to punish Cookie. 
will not stun, but Arya's Tumblr's toy in. He'll toss back the Ursa. Buy back from Michael, booking the charge on through Gobble Up. Stuns Illich. Illich is low. Tomato is leaving. Knight's still the target. Nature's Prophet down. And Knight and Excel must run away. Moon Meander wants to answer. Get to find down there. Tomato blinks in. Ursa is going to attempt the man fight his way out, breaking down Moon Meander, but it will cost him his life. He's currently in a very rough fight right now. Michael saved him, however. He's charging through, distracting entirely, breaking down Brile. Tomato will avenge him. But Knight has returned, looking to man fight. Sven will be giving just a blink away. With the buyback from Excel, it's time to run. Alonis respawns in the fight, punching up the tiny. Ari will toss him back, avalanching the follow. But there's too many running him down. The snowball will right safe lane T2 and then the outpost. But he's an oh, blink punch there into Mata. He still has two lives, Five however, seconds. one of them. Oh, he's two waiting. seconds. They're looking to play it. But no, they will not break it in time. Oh, He's fully he regen up. Oh no, an absolute disaster. The oh. suns come through and Thunder Lake are collapsing right now. Already three dead. Oh no. That was almost huge. Steps ahead again from Neff. Uh, Meanwhile, speaking of two steps ahead, both teams have smoked right now in the river. Stand Thunder Awaken. Ari has been punched up. Thunder wants to skill, but the three-man snorkel from Tomato into the chain for us. The Wombo combo comes through. Michael is dead. Alone is dead. Knight is dropping. He's trying to man play and the enrage in the big KP. He's looking to bring that Tomato, and he actually will, but he'll lose his life. Currently a three for one. Now a three for two. Illich keeps him away. Avalanche will cancel that one. That's a full five-man wipe and a five for two in favor of TSM. They managed to get this fan, but it cost them everything. On the dire side jungle, Bryle, he blinks away in time and Ari will avalanche. Tomato engages, but he's been bashed by Knight, brought down in the chain stun. Tomato already down, Ari to join him. At this point, it's time to run it through TSM. That's a bad fight. And guess who just respawned? Our good old friend, Roshan. That's an Aghanim shard and the Edith Immortality. On top of you, Dawnbreaker can globally assist as well. Speaking of, she's almost got the Aghanim Scepter. There's only 20 Speaking gold Speaking of, there's a fight at the Radiant Tri Camp as well. Charge on Saber like Tomato stuns only on one. Solar Guardian comes through. Excel joins the team fight. Everyone's popping their BKBs right now. Saber is nose diving through with his Ogre Steel Totem, but it does not matter. He's already dead. It's time to run for TSM. Tomato, the target. His BKB's already on cooldown. Oh, and no. Knight is man fighting heavily. The Sven will fall. Excel will be the trade eventually, but it's not going over TSM right now. Ari is punched up in the air by alone. And the Tiny will fall. Charge through Snowball as well. There on Moon Meander. A triple kill for Knight on the Ursa. That's a four for two so far. Bryle looks to avenge his teammates. Breaking down alone. Now four for three. He'll do the channel. They do a detection. Sentry Ward. The Sentry Ward saves the fight. Oh my god. They're bringing it. He'll turn with overpower. Charge comes through. Stunning on three for now. Tomato the target. He'll swarm up Spirit Breaker. And now Knight's man fighting with Saber. White. Saber is incredibly low. Tomato is half HP as well. Spice not going over TSM currently as it stands. Punch up the of Tomato, he'll now BKB, turning red, Michael is low, the fight's chaotic and split, Saber White dropping, Tomato is running, Morris Kiss has come through, getting on two for now, Knight will enrage, Orchid there on the tiny, preventing his stuns from coming off, and now Excel will hammer on through, but Bryle is manning up, Snowball comes through, Excel is dead, Moon Meander is in a lot of danger, but so is Knight, TSM focus, they bring down the carry, Dawnbreaker has bought back, but you are down two, neither have a buyback, and TSM turns- and again, find whatever they can find. Ideally, they wrap around and catch the, the enemies on Roshan. Worst case scenario, Sven picks up a double damage rune and runs into your team. Uh, if on scenario, it appears, Thunder Wicked will choose to go on the Tiny. They burst him down immediately. They head to save like his half HP. Dire pop their BKBs. Sanster Gaze comes through on Night Moon will sacrifice himself to try to save Saber Light. He's somehow still in the Sprout, but inevitably his time has come. Three dead, though both Bryl and Tomato got away, yeah. I think. Absolutely. The fact that they've been able to take it with like the run at you heroes and nature's profit is uh, a very telling sign of like the state of this game. And where Thunder Wave can stand in the Charge game. on Saber Light again. Good. Both teams unleash everything. Saber Light, the main target of the Dire right now. He's incredibly low and he's actually going to die. Excel will stun with the Solar Guardian. But in comes Bryle, dishing out huge damage. Moon Meander is low. Illich is low. It's time to run. But no, Moon Meander dead. Piper buys back. Stormbolt through. Looking for Michael. But they're cutting out Tomato for the time being. But no, more Bryle based damage. Michael is already dead. Knight is incredibly low. His BKB is on cooldown, but he still has one more life. Excel to fall, but now can you save Knight? He'll attempt to blink away, but no. Avalanche, BKB now there. He'll enrage, manning up, looking for a dieback on Saber Light. Snowball through by alone once again. It's a one for one trade once. Oh no, Knight has fallen. I think it just came off. 
Avalanche on Knight. He'll enrage just for a little bit of extra survivability. The T4 is dropping. Tomato becomes oh, red. No. He's the thing. Solar Guardian will come through, but Tomato thought is it. The throne, half HP. They're picking out. He's blinking around. Can they stop Tomato? It seems they can't. They want him. The Bash, but Ari, the two man Avalanche. Tomato's hitting the throne. Buildings have been focused. And TSM will take game number one. Over the Ember or some four Ember, but it's probably an offlane. Yeah, that's definitely that's, that's the off lane ball off. That's just a hero with a blink stun. Well, that's to buy the blink, but still, blink stunning strength hero. That's an off laner right there. No, 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 it's Wraith Path. I think it's the God Hand Guild, the one that like Brile and people are in. But oh, there at rotation mid lane, arrow chains on Brile. He's barely alive. Will attempt to run away, but lead in by Michael. Fairy Fire from Brile. Your first blood will go to oh, oh, Michael. Correction, it's a one for one trade. However, the tower might just be okay then. I just put an early point of the reflection here in order to save the enemy. Seems like Excel is going to go down though. He's being linked by a Saberlight. Classic Field comes through and eventually Saberlight secures the kill. Knight will get away. He has left his Jakura to die and he will return to. I would say farming, but he's not He's not having a fun time right now. No, he's not. I mean, the Savior T1 Tower, we saw last game the power of the Radiant mid T1 Tower, and, and for now it's still healthy. Though Brile is, is going on in already. Alone will have to change, but in comes Moomy at the wraparound rotation. Alone is going to Fairy Fire, but eventually he will die for the Crystal Nova. Michael leaps in looking for Brile. He does not find the kill next to the Raindrop. Uh, you want bottom lane? Meta from Knight. He's manning up with Saber Light. Ice Path comes through. Moomy under TP's in. He'll attempt to save. He frostbites Excel. Knight is juking now on the run. Excel is dropping. Knight is dropping. Michael TP's in arrow. Will hit on Saberlight. Michael leaps in to bring down the Very Razor. Nice. It's a one for one trade for now. But this is a fantastic rotation from Michael. Mm -hmm. But we're not done yet. Frostbite on Terror Blade. With the stick and the infused raindrop, he'll be fine for now. Yeah. Well, he... Good. Speaking of Razor, bottom lane, he'll go on Excel. A normal remnant in. The fight is breaking out. Excel might drop, but it will be a very good trade in favor of- Oh, the, the neutral deny! The neutral deny! Oh no! From bad to worse. Ari seems like he'll get away, but that's, that was already not a great trade. Now it's an even worse trade. Yeah, up the top lane, uh, you're getting dived on a slaughter by Crystal Mania. Moon Meter is running you down. He has, oh uh, he's my Crystal Nova in one. He's not in range. Yeah. Slight chains there on both of the TSM heroes. He'll infest Moon Meander now to popping out to heal his Crystal Maiden alone. Has a double damage rune. Looks for Moon Meander. Arrow, the lead stun there. Into the right click. Ice path there just for good measure. Overall, Moon Meander. And it's, it's, he's doing it. He's choosing this engagement. He'll flip the remnants, but will not activate it. Radiance top tower is under attack. I mean, Viper picked up a double damage in there. He'd be happy to take a fight. Maybe once the Ricky is back, alone's gonna come in though. I mean, again, Bro's gonna pop his TV. R.I.P. Moon Meander. The trade may be for Michael. He's dropping the damage from Tomato and Brile. Knight is the new target. But Dire have been changed on to from alone. Saber White's half HP. Remnant will come in. Ari blinks in, silencing Jakiro and Slardar. Slardar pops Mask Mask looking at Bash alone. Is walking in, walking out, has abilities once again, but does not get the slate of fist off. Nearly the chains. This will be a dead Marana for a dead Crystal Maiden, the one for one support trade. Slick move there by uh, Moon, dropping the freezing field and being able to uh, hop inside of him. With the infest. Survive Tomato. Out, but Speaking of Tomato, he's in down. danger again, bottom lane. He has rage but no infest. He'll pop the rage, he'll pop the pink ball, but he's been madness. bashed by Illich. One more bash comes through, he has so one more bash with the kill. Speed. What? The pathing! The pathing! The pathing? The armor toggles. Meanwhile, Michael dies over in the mid lane, but it's Tomato dying in the bottom lane. Interesting fight. Ultimately, a good one for Thunder Awaken across the okay. map, even with that one. So, one. what happens there is I think he moves into the fall. Well, he's getting gone on by Slara with that shard. Targeting him, not a fun time. Meanwhile, on the dire side, jungle. In comes Jakiro. Arrow to fly. We'll hit the Crystal Maiden. Jakiro is dead, but alone. Thought about remnanting in, but went against the very bold play, remnanting into three heroes. Uh, are you sure? With the slight chain, so slightly less risky, but still wants to kill on Crystal Maiden. Brile and Ari are backing him up. He still has that remnant. Illich is rotating over through the river. Brile shows his face. Meanwhile, Ari's in the south side, sleeping, darting the Slardar. Arrow is there on Brile. He's dropping, and he's going to die. And at this point, if you're TSM, your Viper is dead. It's time to run. Problem is, Illich says, no, I am faster than you. Ooh, the back damage. 
Ricky, the sleeping dart, attempting to run away, but alone secures that kill. Ice path on two, arrow on Tomato. TSM, they're beginning to collapse. One more jump from the Slardar. He's bashing, he's crushing, doing huge damage. Saberlight has thousands to fight. Marana on the run, speaking from Slardar. Infest, heal Saber, light Tomato slow. Moon Meander's low. Saberlight trying to stand his gravity sap they and dropping. Moon Meander is dead. Bash on Saberlight. Arrow comes through. It's missing, but it will not matter. Saberlight dead. A huge fight win in favor of the side of Thunder Wicked. And they want one more. Tomato needs to arm with Toggle. Correction, he needs to walk away, regardless. However, and Ricky is, is being a Ricky. I don't think that Thunder Awaken know he's here. Correction, they do know he's here. He's already dead. Good kill there, though it was only a Ricky who was distracting everybody. Yeah, I mean, he was following them for a while there. He ended up scouting out the rotation that they were trying to make down the bottom lane, too. On the top lane. Yeah, it's an even bigger kill on Saber Light if they get it. And it seems like in this 3v1, it will be inevitable. Arrow from short range was there from Michael. The Bloodstone is giving some healing. He's running in the trees. In comes the Bash. He's still healing. 400 HP. Running away. Arrow's up in three. Excels. Meanwhile, dead. The Bridal is out on the south map. Over to the north side again. Crush is there to bring down Saber Light. Across the map, a two for one. One that I'm sure if you're done to awaken, you're still very happy with. Maybe he pops his BKB there so he doesn't take- Anna, Michael has two leaps and a four staff still. He'll force, but a good read from Ari. He prepped the smoke cloud. Problem is, in come the cavalry. Thunder Ray can arrive. Big bad Slardar. Looks for a big bad man fight. Halbert from Tomato. Excel is like that off for one. Excel again. He's back to the grave. TSM are still fighting. Looking towards Michael. Moon Meander's walking in. Reflection will be there on three. Blink. Crush on two. Viper, the target. Ryle stands his ground. Slara's half HP. Razor's half HP. Ember has been slept. Thunder Awaken are beginning to take some huge damage, but they'll bring down Sabre before that happens. They're running away. Terror Blade's dropping. Michael is dropping. Alone, but his BKB's man fighting, bringing down the wolf. The wolf has fallen in the arrow on Tomato. TV mans up. The Mice Armor is there. He's still half HP. Bryle mans up. The man fighting's massive. Alone. He's run to the north side, but Michael has died in the south side to the Viper damage over time. And at this point, after a very awkward. Rats. That would be very bad in the man fighting carry of the likes of Lifestealer. Mm -hmm. TSM Smoke, they're fighting into two lives on Terror Blade, a bold gambit. They see Excel. Like they'll engage on Jakuro. They'll get forced in, I believe, accidentally by himself. himself. And now, TSM with one kill looks. Big, damn, big DPS. MKB Absolutely. and Monkey. Yeah, MKB and Daedalus. It's a fight of offlaners. Both of them are taking a lot of damage. Arrow will hit on Saber Light alone and get into the BKB. Tomato pops out, breaking down the Slardar. A big kill to start the fight. Alone still hasted. Running down Moon Meanders. Haste has ended, but it'll be the one for one trade. There's a jail on the floor somewhere. Did T run by it? Oh, good arrow. Yeah, this will slow this one down. Find time it even... for Thunder to arrive. They're smoked up on four right now. They actually, TSM are forced to back off. Yeah. Sick. But yeah. now they smoke as well as five. In the river, both smokes pop, chains on two. In comes Slardar. He's been disarmed though. A good halberd in time. He'll crush on two. Slardar is low. Saberlight is low. The offlaners may both drop. Saberlight dead, but Slardar still alive. Ryle will bloodstone, but he's slow with the Scotty. His regen has been reduced. Alone is low, but Bryle is dead. Alone, he's still alive. The Bastion Tomato, he wants alone desperately. He'll get that kill, but for TSM, it is a disaster. Tomato is trying to get away. He will use the rage, but he's fighting with his dieback teammates. Ice Path hits on two. Viper needs to run. If he dies, it will be a dieback. I'm trying to uh, the disarm, but I think if terribly hitting you, if Terrible not disabled, you just straight up lose the fight. Noroshan pit yeah. once again. Excel unleashes the arsenal, trying for kills. Alone buys back. It'll be a 5v5. Roshan is low, but not dead yet. Michael leaps in. Tomato rages. He's focusing Roshan. In comes alone. In comes everybody. Who grabs everything? Everything in the pit. Alone will grab it. Huge for the side of Thunder Awaken. And now they will lose one life on Ember. But Slardar is here. Terrorblade is here. It may be time to fight. Ember returns. But I think he's on cooldown. He uses it to grab the Aegis. He's dead. That's a dieback on alone. But was an absolute miracle has turned into an absolute disaster. Michael is on the run, and they see the Marana. They will bring down the Marana with one more hit. He'll attempt the TP. Not quite in time. Brought down by Saberlight. And you have lost yeah. the buy camp. TSM Smoke. They have obtained some high ground real estates. They have a ward in the low grounds. Michael has been sleep darted. What is the follow up stun? It will be Tomato walking forward looking for a bash. Michael has used his leaps, he'll force death. He's out of escape. 
but I'm not sure if TSM know that. They'll commit regardless, they'll bring down Morana. Michael has a buyback. Ice Path hits on Saberlight. Illich wants an angle. Knight uses the meta. In comes Florida. He'll BKB. He'll bash. Morana buys back. Alone. Engages. The chains. The right clicks. Illich is manning up, looking for the kill on Brow, but he's invested. He's healed. He's kept alive, but not for long. Slardar and Knight, they're both dropping. Problem saved by force to use his cheese. Regen reduced by Scotty. And Razor is dead. Crush. Oh god, Ricky gets annihilated and they head over to Moon Meander. He's brought down as well. One key problem. Look at the available buybacks. There's only one. Oh. Regardless, the buildings are not surviving. Melee's dead. Range Rack's dead. Still a minute. Link's on in. They want Saberlight. Ice Path hits on two. Thunder Awaken. Want game two. They find the jump on the Razor and they bring him down. As a dieback on Saberlight. Tomato. He's trying. He's manning up, but he's kited around. His rage has ended and his life will soon end right afterwards. Down goes Tomato with no buyback. Ari is dead. That is a dieback. That is a full five man wipe. And Thunder Awaken will bring us and all deciding game number three. Yeah, they're going for the throne now. There's nothing that they're able to do about this one. One swift team fight victory, and that is it. Moon Meander calls it. So, their builds is hilarious. They found this Phoenix last pick with the 23 pick here. Uh huh. And uh, they uh, pick Zeus last on Thunder Awaken, which still doesn't tell us anything until they log. Okay. He's going to be alone on the Zeus, so that will be uh, mid. Support Ember. Mm hmm. The Zeus will be able to secure that. They play there by him. Like you said, 16 steps ahead. It's one of those things. I think T actually mid lane receiving a bit of rotation. Never mind. Unless. Yeah, he's still fine, I think. He said it'll raise Michael. Michael has no flame guard. He's huge short range raise. Illich TP's in. And first blood will go to alone. Okay then. That will be first blood going to the Zeus. Yeah, Meanwhile, seeing... top lane, they bring down Ari as well. Not quite sure how cross farm impacting the game. He's currently fourth in the network, which is. Well, tell better me your theory. Master. Why is it that alone uh, hasn't been having good games? Brile simply better? Or... I mean, TSM, they've been focusing him down. Mid lane Requiem from Brile to escape the gank. He's feared away all three. He's now running to the northwest towards Excel to turn to alone. The two race combo brings down yeah. the hero X. Mogul Khan. That looks cool. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember the, the, the fun names that they had for them? Mogul Khan touched this. I like the ones where they, uh, they, they they mentioned like players. Wait, mid lane, fight in the river, alone is tossed up, brought down, and the hero of Merlini will fall to Bryo Shadowfiend, the one of Yafets. And with two references at Wonder Wicked Heroes in the bottom Ooh, lane, hook for one hook. Range. Oh my, beautiful play from Tomato. The beautiful game going on right now. Illich will attempt to TP away, but it'll die to the rot damage. Over to Michael. He's running away, but he's running into, well, a Bryo Shadow Fiend, raising him down to the ground. Two kills for the side of TSM. And we've seen Thunder Awaken doing some great aggression the last few minutes. Going, We've seen a couple of uh, safe lane pudges go straight for uh, like Aegidim Scepter or something recently. And it feels like they just aren't able to fight because of it. Meanwhile, Thunder Awaken flood into the bottom lane. They're getting straight to a bit of a dive right now, but the TP's in from TSM. Freezing field hook from Tomato. They bring down Excel, and the remainder of the team will scatter. Running to the north, away from the TS. Out to him, which uh, he'll have another 300 gold. Well, the fight breaks out at the eastern part of the Radiant Jungle. Orchid on Saber Light. Thunder Rick will focus him down before the speed. Yeah, there's no spells coming out there. But a hook again from long range on Knight. He has the Wukong. So right now, TSM are losing the fight. Their tower is dead. There are no more TPs. Alone, at least the Thunder Gods wrath to bring down Ari. Tomato will attempt to eat up the gyro, but inevitably he will perish. That's a three kill streak there for Thunder Awaken. TSM get nothing but walking away with sadness. Yeah, it doesn't bode well for them. But yeah, the, the animation on it, I believe, is too long. Uh, you need to, like, animation cancel and then do it. If you have an Aetherlands, you can do it. Ooh, wait, they've caught Knight. They killed his tree. He's temporarily stunned. He'll bound the strike on two. He'll bring down Ari before he... Wait, he's not dead. He's now finally dead. Meanwhile, we see Excel dying. So across the map, it's a two for two. See, Ooh. Phoenix and Tiny for Gyro and Monkey King. Really chaotic in terms of that fight. Who me under dead? Seems like he's dead. He's being remnant. Meanwhile, top lane. See a missile going in on Sableight. They want to bring down the Phoenix as well. He's low on HP, still has Supernova and a Yule's available. 
Cell shows his face, so call now. Sunray comes through. Now it's like we'll cancel Move Meander has fallen. Saberlight remains low, but he remains alive. He'll use Supernova. Thunder Awakening to focus it down. Ooh. Down goes Saber Chad and Tomato. Ooh, Ooh. TP just in time. Yeah, nice try there by alone, but no doubt. He's going to need a lot of control from his team. He's no Siege Wagon right after target. all. That is true. Top lane E Blade on Tomato. TP in by Illich. They focus down the carry Pudge. The fight continues. Saberlight dives in, dives away. Illich will BKB. Meanwhile, it's time to run for TSM. Moon Meander has already fallen. Bryle pump fakes the Requiem. He wants to perhaps catch them on a, a fake retreat, but he turns the fake retreat into a real retreat. Two for zero for Thunder Awaken. A very particular strategy. I mean, this is a strategy that got them to uh, to second place at the Stockholm Major, and they have four to five of that exact team. Oh, they so. were winners in my heart. They were winners in my heart they too. They ran through the upper bracket. They they played the entire EU DPC in like two days. And they had a winning record in those series, but unfortunately, yeah. what can you do? Yeah. The only reason Ari blinks in, speaking of EU, toss over yeah. Zeus. Who comes, comes through from Knight? Zeus is dead. They've lost alone. Thunder Awaken around the run. Reckon comes through, fearing away three heroes. Knight is manning up. Michael dead. Excel dead. Three down for Thunder Awaken. And TSM are still there as five. Knight's man fighting with the Jingu, but they'll get brought down. TSM, a four for zero. And we were starting to have concern. Yeah, that one, but yeah, it looks like Ari was holding onto the toss to be able to interrupt a TP. So he's supposed to BKB then TP out. Excel. Uh, He's not going to be so lucky. Avalanche, the right clicks. No crits from Bryla, but apparently crits are not needed in the 4v1. Yeah, He's not dead for a full 40. This much damage. Uh, we've uh, lost the second life, by the way. Aegis has expired, so I will not be in play for at least the next three minutes, possibly longer, depending on when Roche wakes up from his slumber. Yep, there's been casting a lot of spells out. This is not dying. Yeah. At the very least, you know, he's got the Aghanim Shard on alone, so he's doing percentage-based damage with Pudge, which I think is the majority of what he's taking right now. Oh, yeah. Going in on Pudge, Avalanche hits on two, both will BKB. Wukong's comes in from Knight, Saber pops the Supernova, Dyer trying to kill it, it's half HP, quarter HP, already dead, TSM, lose, they lose one, but they've killed two, Briable Manta, not dodging missile, but Michael's forced to remnant away. And with no Monkey, and with no Nature's Prophet, they both lack a buyback, TSM, they don't know that. They do not know there are no buys. It's a lack of gold on both of them. Yeah, unfortunately. But they poke for tier fours. Yeah, there's nothing to be gained here other than going for the tier fours. Oh and everybody! My God. Michael's already dead. Alone's dropping as well. He'll e blade himself. Oh. But raises the damage. Ember buys back. Alone to fall. Gyro and Zeus. They have no buyback. Michael will not die. But Ryle's dodging the fountain. He wants the full wipe. He gets the full wipe. And just like that, team at solo mid, they are going to defeat Thunder Awaken. Two to one. TSM uh, coming in clutch and Bryle. He dropped some items. <laughs> well, were those mantles intelligence? What were they? <laughs>